Hi, there were some questions from Sumalinks about the phrase in the Blagli research, so I would like to address it in this video. I also created a video for demonstration of the steps how to bring the phrase research into Blagli and its real-time application. I'm Gennady Batrako, founder of Blagli, and I'm very passionate about the subject since it's how my journey for the Blagli app has begun. Well, Phrase is an AI-driven platform to quickly create content that answers visitor question. They solve one problem for the user, research. Excellent application. Just a quick statement here. Blagli has its own research process that generates research docs. But since people like Phrase and purchase their services, they can use it in combination with Blagli. Blagli is an app that focuses on original content creation and distribution. As I explained in my previous video about Blagli research, topic research is a critical part of the content creation. Phrase is a great platform to generate well-researched content briefs very quickly. Yes, it works very well and the user gets the results quickly and able to collect data in their research document by simply clicking on the paragraphs. This doc can be exported as PDF and used as a material for article writing. It's all great. But now what? This is just a document with well done, thorough research information. It can be used as a supplemental material for the article you are trying to produce. But now you are stuck with the same problem that many writers have. You have a disjoint document that is disconnected from your actual writing doc. Today, majority of writers, bloggers and in general content creators use Google Docs or Word files. Some more advanced writers use apps like Scrivener, somewhat complex to use. They are all still disconnected from your research doc. God forbid to use the research doc straight for your blog post article. That would be absolutely dumb idea, besides being unethical. I'm not a proponent of plagiarism. In fact, I am totally against it. And we made it very clear in our app that our focus is original content. We wholeheartedly support originality. And yet, in order to write content that you will be proud of, you need a comprehensive topic research before you start writing. You will have this research doc at your fingertips. And you have an overview of what your competitors write on that specific topic. However, if you bounce between the Google Doc and research doc at the same time, you are not going to be effective. Here is the solution. Associate the document with your content directly and have the ability to view and write in a helpful split screen. This is what we've implemented in Blagli. We introduced association and convenience. We made the research info not to be a nuisance in the whole writing process. As I already said, we have our own research docs based on the top 100 SERPs. But the question was how phrase research docs can be used in Blagli. No problem, there are a few ways that can be done. Import as article, export HTML file and phrase, and import into Blagli. It takes only a few seconds. But there is a downside to this method it will create a separate article in Blagli. The second method, copy and paste research doc into Node. It is the simplest solution and most adequately aligned with your writing. In your phrase doc, select the entire content of the research doc and copy it to your clipboard. In your Blogly article, go to the desired block of your content, open assets on the left side, select the tab Nodes and create a new node. Just copy the content in the new node. It will be the simplest solution and most properly aligned with your writing. Just to summarize, Phrase is a great app as far as the comprehensiveness of information. But it is not the writing or publishing software. If you really want to use Phrase docs in Blogly, use method number two. Create note in Blogly article dedicated to research that you made in Phrase. By doing this, you will be the most effective and productive. 